I'm Robert Stubblefield and I teach creative writing and composition here at the University of Montana. I'm a lecturer in the English department. My name is Claire Venner. Um, my major is English Creative Writing and I'm a senior this year. Um, my piece is called Give the Dog a Bone and it's about dog fighting in a small town in New Mexico. Um, and it's like a it's kind of a family drama, I guess. <laughs> uh, the poetry for lunch reading was initiated by Sue Sampson um, several years before the Oval came on board, and then the Oval's been doing it for 10 years. The Oval is the undergraduate literary magazine here at the University of Montana. It was started entirely by students 10 years ago, gained support from the department, the creative writing program, uh, particularly the Mansfield Library. Um, I submitted my piece to the Oval and then um, when I found out that my piece was going to get published they asked if I could do a reading. So It was really nerve-wracking. <laughs> um, I was super nervous and um, but it was really nice because there was a lot of familiar faces in the crowd from people that I had um, taken workshops with and also professors that I had recognized and so um, it was a really an ultimately great experience. Well, I think the poetry for lunch and readings in general um, give the writer a chance to share their work because so much literary work is produced and edited almost entirely in solitude, and so it's nice to get that out there before an audience and see what connects with people, and especially with poetry for lunch because not only do you have your audience that's here at the Mansfield for the event, but you have people coming in and walking by who occasionally hear something that catches their ear or their eye. And so it's a chance to, um, to kind of bring that work that's done in private out into the public and out into the world. You're surrounded by all of these words and past authors, and um, so it's a great place, I think, just for students to have the opportunity to, to read their, their work that's getting published and, you know, we'll, guess join the shelves. <laughs>